In this tutorial, I'll cover the following topics. We'll take a quick look at what's in the box. We'll look at the bottom of the phone and see where to connect the handset, ethernet cables, and the power cord. Then I'll show you how to attach the reversible stand for 30 and 60 degree viewing angles. When you order one of these SIP telephones, inside the box you'll find the telephone, a handset and cord, and a reversible stand. Now let's turn the phone over and look at the bottom of the phone. There are three jacks or connectors on the bottom of the phone and one optional power connection. The first connector we'll look at is the handset connector. Attach the handset and handset cord. Then plug the handset cord into this connector. To secure the cord, route the cord through the grooves as shown here. The next two connectors are the LAN and PC Ethernet connectors. The LAN connector must be connected to your network. This is the connector that will give your phone telephone service. I'll talk about the PC connector in just a minute. If your company provides inline power or power over Ethernet, you will not need to use the optional AC power adapter. This is because your phone is getting the power from the Ethernet connection. But if your company does not provide power over Ethernet, then you will need to use the optional AC power adapter. Plug one end into the phone and the other end into an AC outlet. Now let's talk about the PC connector. These phones have a built-in high-performance Ethernet switch. This means you can share a single network connection with your phone and your PC and maintain a high quality throughput. This can be very helpful if there's only one network connection in your area. With the main network connection plugged into your LAN connector, then a second cable is used to connect your phone's PC connector to your computer's Ethernet card or connector. This way, with no additional equipment, you can share one network connection with both your phone and your computer. Now let's attach the reversible stand. The stand provides a 30 degree or 60 degree viewing angle. Attaching the stand like this will give the phone a higher 60 degree viewing angle. Slide the stand to the right and it will snap into place. To change the viewing angle to 30 degrees, we will need to reverse the stand. Slide the stand to the left to remove it, then turn the stand around, and then reattach it. Insert your cables into the flexible rubber grips to hold and neatly organize your cables. This concludes the hardware overview. Additional tutorials are available on the 6863i.